we don't Sorry. even have our own billable income, yet still yeah. we are claiming to be in, independent. People, try to understand something. Jamaica could have regulated the marijuana business so much that everybody could get a slice of the and, pie. And yes, and yes, still, all them did they do, take up the marijuana and lock it up. For what? Just to go sell the import to them idiot friend them. Them yeah. idiot rich friend them want to know nothing. Right? Try to understand something. Jamaica quick forgive marijuana licensing to other people from other countries. Can I get the one black man them, the man them who can use something for turn it and medicinal herbs. They mm -hmm. use it for profit for the country. Oh no, we can't have that. How dare you? You so scum of society. Right? So is Canada Canada making money off of our weed? Not only are they making money off of our weed, they're exporting it to their country. Are you serious? At no, at no cost at that. Come on, Jamaica still I get a piece of that one. Jamaica still have said, still Jamaica, not the people them. Jamaica. Yeah. yeah. So what they look at and say, look on that, eh? That is so dumb. First off, you can't export my weed to your country. Just so. Before it reaches it, at first going on my control. Which I thought they would have done first, but I don't know. America, Jamaica don't learn, don't for suck, suck him, 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 him white overlord them very well. So, yep. I remember man, this is also the same. And people, that's added more to more salt to the wound. Not only did Jamaica sell, sell America um, a license for grow weed at Jamaica. I mean, I'm America, I mean Canada. But now, years later, CM Canada is now pumping money into the country again to push the LGBTQ argument all over the island. Yes, people, it ever starts slow first. Right now, them going after the university pinning them, which is no, which is no joke. I'm gonna go after the university pitney them. So, yeah. That's not and people again. Do it's apologize it's for that we did um go on with this, but you know, I no. believe we had to just get that out there yeah. because honestly, okay. y'all now pay attention. I don't know who go pay attention for me. Exactly. So it's, it's breaking. It's it, it, ridiculous. It, it, it in Panalico sour note, but yeah. I'd rather end on sour note than not telling the truth to these people. And eventually, some on Africa will wake up. Because me and uh -huh. Bradshaw, uh -huh. it will get tiresome eventually. Uh -huh. so, we, can all, we can only try people. Let me say, the ideology right now, we need to fight back. And from what I've read and what I've heard, in order to change back the mindset of the West, you have, take you, have to, you have to fight. You have to do it. Yeah. And it, you know, I just took, since night, right before my ritual, mm -hmm. I was reading the panel where Dr. Doom was speaking with the Panther God of uh, Wakanda. Mm -hmm. And. Bass. The man. <laughs> yeah. And the man. This guy tell Panther God, say, Yo, you want to know why I despise Reed Richards and Tashala so much? Because they've never ever asked me why I'm doing the things I do. They just think I'm evil for the sake of evil. Mm -hmm. And that part stuck with me. I, mean, I always used to say, Yo, there's no way this man just try to take over the world for, you know, reasons. Mm -hmm. The man say, Yo, every future that I've been to, same bullshit, violence. Mm -hmm. Our spread, disease, mm -hmm. no health care, everyone is uneducated. Mm -hmm. I'm like, huh, isn't that society right now? Yes, it is. Yes, and then you know what man said? Man said, out of a million futures, I've seen only one, despite where anyone who commits a crime, similar to what like when I try to, but it's more subtle. You know, people thrive, health care available for everybody. And the pan and the panther got say yo, despite my reservations and nature saying no, and despite your vileness, I can't deny that you're not wrong. 
Of course. Pan God can find out, say, yo, yes, that is the only way for your bright future. What the difference with we? Try to understand something. I'm saying this to most people. The whole notion, say, you know, that for peace reign, you just have to change the way people think No. In order to maintain peace, you have to be willing to be violent. And I believe that's also one of the arguments that most people don't want to address. The lack of, the, 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 the over-emphasis on this whole, you can talk your way to peace, doesn't work. Because they're just like, I'm looking look at anime, for example. I don't really want to go all over the universe, but look at anime, as for example. Look at Naruto. Baruto. This is after the third world war, when everybody should be appreciating the facts that, you know, we almost all died. People already in a different ninja village, them already a free war again. Mark you, world war three just literally done what it And people already start keep up them fuck already. So no matter what you do that, you can't please everybody. Sure, peace will reign, but it yeah, not going to reign forever. We need violence to keep it, keep it in check. I know people don't believe that, but it's true. We need violence to keep peace in check. It's not as, as white, black and white as people would love it to be. We have to think, you have to think like it's like fifth dimensional chess you play. Not, yep. just, not just regular chess. You have to can see it from different, different angles nowadays. People, men, men are not men like that no more. You realize there's a soft undertone when you talk to most men. You realize there's a hard undertone when you talk to most women. Tell a girl, say, yo, even if I was cheating, I'll never look at your direction. Say, well, are you gay? I said, no. But fucking woman like you would make me feel like I'm gay. So what do you mean by that? <laughs> oh, God damn it. It's not like I've been talking to a dude the last 20 flipping minutes. Fuck me for mood now, man, for... That flat, she couldn't get past it. She couldn't understand the message. And she cussed me out. I said, well, that's where you go. Yeah. Again, you know, of discernment, sir. Not people don't yep. have it. We mm-hmm. can hope that we do change a few minds along the way. Mm-hmm. But you know, before this, let's get out of hand because, God yeah. damn. Yeah. Good stuff. Good yep. stuff. How would they ask it so long? Good stuff. I appreciate the insight. And honestly, people, leave wake up. Y'all need to wake the fuck up. Because okay. it's not going to get easier from here. So, but I lose faith now. No, no the rest of everybody else might lose faith, but I haven't. So, that said, Racha as always, always a pleasure. No more next week, same time again. And guidance, my bro. Ah, you got to